Those who regularly play or have experienced tabletop RPGs that go beyond basic dice rolling, numbers and statistics will know just how quickly you can become absorbed in the world you're exploring. Some players may find themselves exploring the terrible and fascinating worlds inspired by HP Lovecraft, and may even use scenarios devised by the boffins at Chaosium for the Call of Cthulhu series. Now, regular iOS gamers can do the same with The Wasted Land, developed by Red Wasp Design, though a few changes have been made in the process. Foremost is the switch to a tactical turn-based RPG setup. Given the game's World War I trench warfare setting, it's a change that works in the game's favour, with players controlling several investigators at a time, battling against the supernatural forces set against them. Each character sports the usual slew of statistics, ranging from fundamental values such as strength and dexterity, as well as more specialised values representing a character's skill with certain weapons or items. These can affect the accuracy with a weapon or item, how many action points are available, and more importantly the character's sanity. Lowered sanity can result in incapacitating or frenzying, which are both ill-advised. However, you may need to toe the line closely as spells expend sanity, though the payoff is often more than worth the risk. However, battling against German occult forces is not as easy as it sounds. Not just because the game itself throws up lengthy and challenging fights, but because the controls and interface make things far more difficult than they should be. In the release build used for this review, touching the screen resulted in a 50-50 chance of recognition of a tap. Swiping to look around the battlefield was seemingly not affected, but buttons, selecting individual units and attempting to double tap to perform actions was painful to say the least. Coupled with an archaic interface that throws up numbers as though they impart meaning, it's a game designed with a certain type of tactical player in mind, and not a broader audience. This is a shame as the almost horror survival feel of the tactical gameplay and trench warfare scenario meshes well with the Lovecraft mythos of ancient cults and horrible creatures best left unseen. Sadly, unravelling this mystery is made more difficult than it should be thanks to a clunky old school tactical system and controls that, by this time in iOS game development, are frankly unforgivable. This has been Andrew with AppSpy.com. We review, you decide.